So hello guys, good evening. It's me again, Nicola Siran from BSTCM 1K2. So for tonight's video, I would like to share the lessons that we have tackled lately. So my classmates discussed about utilitarianism. So actions are morally permissible if and only if they produce at least as much as net happiness as any other available actions. So, in other words, the more happiness and less suffering that results from our actions, the better the action is. And the right action is the one that produces the greatest balance of happiness over suffering. So, Jeremy, Ven Jeremy Bentham published a long defense of utilitarianism. So, it was called... An introduction to the principle of morals and legislation in 1789 he was also a very politic politically and socially active man so for example of the utilitarianism in an emergency situation I am left with with the six patients and only six I mean only five medicines left so all of whom need the drug to survive but one of them badly need the five medicines in order to survive so the other five patients the other five patients can survive on a single dose of medicine so in utilitarianism it will tell us to, di to divide up the drug saving the five patients and allowing the one patient to die. Why? Because saving the five lives preserves much more happiness and prevents much, much more suffering than saving just one life. And in that case, that seems like the right decision or the right action. And that would be all. Thank you. I hope you learned something about this vlog. Bye. Good night.